turns lot for Halloween. <laughs> okay, Ava and I just got to the store. We are on a mission to surprise Turin by decorating his locker today. He has no idea. I don't think he knows if I know which locker is his, what his locker combination is. We are going to sneak into the school before he gets out of school, put some fun things in it, and then check him out of school. He's gonna come to his locker and we're gonna be hiding, waiting to see his reaction. He has actually been begging me for the last few weeks to take him to the store because he wants mints and some candy and some snacks for his locker. And I keep telling him no, because I've had this planned for a little while and he keeps getting so frustrated. <laughs> He just thinks I'm the meanest mom ever. So I am so excited to surprise him today. I cannot wait to see his reaction. <gasps> Ava, look at this carriage. Oh my goodness, this is what little girl dreams are made of. So Ava's a tiny bit confused. She knows that we're decorating Turin's locker, but she thinks we're decorating it for Halloween because it is also that time of year and we need to decorate my house soon, but I haven't quite gotten to that yet. So I am looking for a few extra things. I ordered some things on Amazon. I'm hoping that they're actually going to show up today before I need to go decorate his locker or I'm in big trouble. We are looking for a few extra things and then we're gonna go over to the snack aisle and get some yummy stuff. I'm actually having trouble finding any locker accessories because it is a month after school started. It's actually more like five or six weeks after school started. So they have clearanced out most of that kind of stuff, most of all the school supplies. So it's been a little bit tricky. I did have to order some on Amazon. I'm not having a ton of luck. I think I might have to go to more of like an Office Depot type place and hope I can find more stuff. You gonna get the milk? Need some help? Here you go. Can you put it in the cart? Good job. We got out Ava's winter bin yesterday and she decided that she wanted to wear her Christmas dress from last year today. Okay, we are definitely covered in the treat department. I did not find a ton in the school supply department, so we are going to have to go to another store. I did get him some really good fun treats though. I am not really good at being fun in this regard. As far as doing fun things, doing fun adventures, I'm all for it. But I have a hard time feeding my kids junk all the time, so they kind of tease me. So I tried to be fun today, you guys. I'm trying to be a fun mom. So I bought him lots of things that I wouldn't necessarily want him to be snacking on during the school day. Okay, between three stores, I found everything I was looking for, but I have been panicking because my Amazon stuff has not been delivered yet. One thing is in the mailbox, I'm about to go grab that. But the other two things say that they're out for delivery and they said it as of noon, which sometimes means it's not gonna be delivered for a while. So I just barely logged back in. I've been logging in like every five seconds to see <laughs> if it's been delivered. I have been calling everywhere to see if I can find those other things that are coming. I called Dollar Tree, I called Walmart, I called Zerkers, I called everywhere saying, do you have a mini basketball hoop? Because that's one of the things that's coming that he's going to love. And I just barely locked back, back on. I've never even seen this before. It tells me that it's nine stops away. I have to leave in like less than five minutes and I'm just like, <sighs> It's so silly. It's not even like the end of the world, but when you get something and you're so excited about it and then it doesn't come, it's kind of like a major buzzkill. So I'm so excited that it's coming. I hope that the UPS driver starts moving really, really quickly or I'm gonna be in trouble here. Okay, you guys, I had to give up. I waited until five stops away and I thought, I've gotta go because I decided to pick up a very special helper today that is quite the pro at decorating lockers. You might've met him before. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, he didn't know that I was coming to get him. He gets out of school before Turin, so I stole him so he could come help me because he is so good at this. I'm so excited. And we are seriously freaking out. We are so excited. I thought I was gonna get checked out because I have a cavity. <laughs> and I thought I was gonna checked out to like go get like a shot and have them fix it. Is this a little bit better? Yes, way better. <laughs> so he's gonna help me, and he brought a very special thing along to make this experience even better. Oh yeah. But the best news is we just drove home. The package has arrived! Oh! <laughs> and Ryler decided that it would be way more fun if we put a GoPro in the locker. Oh, yeah. He's so good at this so that we can capture his reaction in case he's facing the wrong way when we're videoing him and hiding. So we're gonna run and go grab that really fast and grab his special little thing that he's bringing along. Okay, right guy, I got him a bunch of good treats. Yes. I got him a mini basketball hoop. Wait. So it's like suction cups to the locker. Um, I might have to take this. <laughs> I got him some strawberry Fanta. The only thing oh. is it's not gonna be very cold. Uh, no, not anymore. <laughs> what did you bring? 
brought my mini fridge. Yes! <laughs> that is the most Boy. amazing mini fridge I have ever it seen. It fits actually six of those. So there's gonna be plenty for you guys to just crack them open together. So you're saying you're gonna let him borrow it for today? Yeah, definitely, my cousin. <laughs> oh my gosh, you are the best. Tell me if you think this is gonna be cool. <laughs> what do you I, think? DJ lights! <laughs> what? So you think he's gonna like it? Way too much. Okay, you guys, when I picked up Riddler, he literally started skipping out of the school, jumping up and down, freaking out. He is so excited to help. He is seriously the sweetest boy, the best friend and best cousin to Turin. I don't know if you've seen, but he designed his very own locker, which is what inspired me to do this. So I thought, I've got to bring him along and have him help me make turns just as cool. Riddler ran inside, got his very own GoPro, got his fridge, and now we are on a race against the clock because he gets out of school in a little over 30 minutes. We have to decorate it and get him checked out a few minutes early so that he can check out his locker before all the kids get excused from school and flood the hallways. Tyler has been assembling things on the way here. He got it all in his backpack. He was putting magnets on the back of the right race board. He was blowing up balls for the basketball hoop. What would I have done without you? We've got Miss Ava holding some things. Oh yeah. She's a big helper. How did this go? Okay, can we do this right guys? Oh, Let's do it. First try. First try. Oh, yes. We just walked by a classroom and it looked like you could have been in it. Like this there video. was one of Ryler's really good friends in there. Hoping you didn't recognize him. Like. And tell everyone in the classroom that we're out here. Smash the like button if you think we're gonna beat the clock. You guys, the level of excitement on this kid is exactly why I brought him. The energy Rai Guy has is my favorite. He's freaking out because the disco ball thing, it's magnetic. Oh my god. Alright, Lyra, Lyra, let's turn this bad boy on. Okay. Oh my gosh. What do you think? What do you think? I like it. Is it awesome? Oh, he's gonna freak out. Oh my gosh, that's kinda cool. That's awesome. <laughs> Nailed it. Who has time for school books when you have all of this in your locker? So Rai Guy is getting Just rid of all the school materials. So long school books. <laughs> Wait, why am I putting them in the backpack? What did you? Them away. <laughs> oh my gosh, you are cracking me up. Okay, Ryler has set up his very own GoPro, GoPro. to yeah, capture Turin's reaction. All right, get that mini fridge pumping. Ryler is smart enough to figure out how to get this mini fridge working without any outlets. Free light. Yes. yes. We are in business, baby. We have 12 minutes before school gets out. We just ran into one of Turin's very good friends. And he's begged, on my football team too. He's on their football team. We begged him, begged him not to tell Turin that he saw us out here. We are about to check him out of school and we are going to watch his reaction. Let's go. Okay, he is officially checked out. We are now waiting. We are hiding. Oh, shoot, that's cash. Durant? No way. Don't let him see him. Don't let him see him. That's cash. How did you see him? Where was he? Eva, get down. Eva, get down. You saw him. Get down. Don't let him see you. Get down. Get down. Get down. Let's just wait until he gets to his locker. I'm so scared. <laughs> oh my gosh! What do you think, dude? Are you serious? I'm serious. I got checked out. <laughs> Rai Guy brought his very own mini fridge just to crack open a soda with you today. I was so confused. I saw it coming through the holes and I'm like, why are there lights on my hands? This is so neat. This is so cool. Seriously, this is awesome. Basketball hoop for you to dunk. Oh. Remember all those times that you kept asking me if I would buy you candy Honestly, and mints? Like candy. Yes. And I kept saying no? Yes. It's because we had this planned.
Greg, I show Turin what all is in this locker. Okay, so first up we got, you know, a little basketball hoop. Dunk dunk. We got the magnets. Uh, we got this magnet. So awesome. A bunch of pens, a little pen holder. Now this is where all the awesomeness starts. <laughs> we got, first of all, a disco light. <laughs> Magnetic. Very bright, yeah. We got a bunch of delicious snacks. And then we also have this mini fridge. Turn, want one? Yes, please. <laughs> And I have one of Where do my books go? Right, guy, where'd they go? Uh, definitely not in my backpack. <laughs> he threw them in the dumpster. He didn't think he needed them anymore. Turn, as soon as I saw Ryler's locker, I knew he had to come help me decorate yours. Is this, this is so perfect because the, we're the mini fridge and I can just stick all my books. <laughs> oh, so you actually care about school? We were thinking we could just throw the books away because look, now you've got way better things to do than learn. Oh my gosh, Ryler. We did it. Turin, were you not gonna go to your locker? No, because I just had set my backpack by the door so I can just leave in the bedroom because it's so much easier. Okay, first of all, we passed the classroom and I'm like, oh my gosh, those look like kids that I know. Like, what if he saw us? Mm -hmm. Then Cash goes to the bathroom and I'm begging him. I'm like, Cash, please don't give it away. I have a surprise for Turin in his locker. Please, please don't say anything. So then he sees you leaving the school, not going to your locker, and what does he say to you? The turn, you just have to go to your locker. He's like, I'm like, why? He's like, I just can't tell you. I'm like, why? Just tell me. He's like, I just can't tell you. Did you think that, that uh, he pranked you or something? I thought, what? I thought one of my friends got in my locker. Because they've been doing that lately. Yeah. And now I think a lot of kids are going to be trying to get into your locker. <laughs> Okay, so we got a disco ball. <laughs> See if hey, you can make shot. it. Ava, you think I can make it? 40. Oh, so close. Ashton, Landon, what's Rag Guy doing here? He's checking out his locker. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what do you think, Ash? What do you think, Land? Rag Guy, I think they might be thirsty. You guys want another strawberry Fanta? Sure. Yeah. Here you go. <laughs> Wait, that's with six sodas? Oh, yeah. wow. There you go, Lando. Okay, you guys, that is over, and I'm a little bit relieved. That was a little bit stressful for a minute there. there I was so many kids. <laughs> oh yeah, there were like in the hallway, they were Too all just many. rushing over. But I mean, I was panicked before I even came and got you because I was on a bit of a time crunch, and I'm going to all these stores. I'm not finding what I need, so I'm, it's not like I got, went to one store and got everything I needed. I'm going to all these different stores. I think we pulled it off. Yeah, we did. By the skin of our teeth, Easy. I think we pulled it off. Yeah. Do you think so, Abe? Did we do yeah. it? We've been shopping all day, Turbo. You have a red mustache. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. Oh yeah. Love this guy. Okay, we are off to another busy night of sports. It's a Tuesday. Tuesdays are crazy for the next couple weeks, as you know. But I just had to get on here and talk about my cute Turin. Oh my goodness, that boy is such a good boy, which is why today was so fun to do something extra, to do something special for him. Um, I purposely did the surprise when nobody was in the hall. I checked him out early when the halls wouldn't be flooded with kids because Turin doesn't love a ton of attention and I knew that it would embarrass him if everyone was around. But the word got out and everybody heard about it and started coming up to see it after school. And you know, he was cute, but I could tell he was a little embarrassed. And afterwards he just said, mom, thank you so much for doing my locker, but I just feel, I just feel like it's so showy. And I love him for that. It is one of his very best qualities is that, he, you know, he has this amazing thing done for him. And the only thing he's thinking about is, is this making other kids feel bad? I mean, honestly, I love that about him. It is such a good quality. That little boy has been like that since day one. He is a friend to everybody. He has a sensitive, tender heart. Uh, um, he is an amazing big brother. He's He's kind of wise and mature beyond his years. He just gets situations that kids his age don't get, which honestly has made him the perfect older brother for our family. Um, because, you know, he's kind of had to grow up a little bit in certain situations and he's had to kind of be a helper with different life situations that we've been through and be sensitive to certain situations. And I just feel like he was so meant to be the oldest in our family. And I love that he's such a good, kind friend to everybody at school and that that was his first thought today. It made me that much happier that, that we did this for him, but it was kind of funny because he just said, Mom, I don't need all of this. He handed me half of it to take back. So anyway, it was a total success. Sure love that boy more than anything. And uh, thanks for coming along with us. Hope you enjoyed the surprise. If you haven't already, subscribe below. Turn on your notification bell so that you can see what else we're doing this week. I promise you, you're not going to want to miss what is tomorrow. It's a pretty big thing for one of my kiddos. 
you're not gonna wanna miss it. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys tomorrow.